So in this video, I'm going to show you how to create a composite, uh, uh, do composite sailing on a mnemonic chart. Okay. So, um, you know, here's your mnemonic chart and, um, you've got, uh, um, you've got this question in planning a North Pacific voyage, you wish to steam a distance, minimum distance between this latitude and longitude that's departure and this latitude and longitude that's arrival. So you're going to start here. You're going to go there. First thing you got to do is you got to find those places, okay? So you got to look on your Mercator chart, I mean on your mnemonic chart, and you know here's your latitude lines. You can read the latitudes right here on the edge of this of it. You can also read the latitudes a couple places uh, out here, like a third of the way out here, okay? And the latitudes are also out here. And then longitudes you can find along this arc here, along this latitude. The longitudes are going to be along the um, uh, what is that? Uh, 20, 20, around, they're going to be on the 30th parallel, okay? So all the longitudes are written on the 30th parallel. They're also written up at the top. But, you know, 4830 north by 12445 west is going to be up here, okay? So that's going to be where we're going to start. So you got to find that point, and then you got to find 44 north by 150 east, and that's over here somewhere. So what the first thing you're going to do is you got to find those points on, you got to plot those points on the thing and then connect them with a line. So there we go. So I connect it with the line. Then what we're going to do is we're going to look for a limiting latitude. We're going to look for any problems along that voyage. Well, it turns out that if we do that voyage, you're going to run right over the Aleutians, okay? We're going to run aground there. And even if we could even sneak through a couple of these passages, you know, if you're a tanker, I don't think they're too happy for you to be going through the freaking Aleutians, you know? So, um, uh, anyway, so uh, we're going to try to find some limiting latitude. So, you know, here's 45, here's 50. And it looks like the Aleutians, you know, if, if we were to zoom in there a little bit, it looks like the Aleutians go to about 52 south. So maybe what we would do is we would say, you know what, I don't want to go farther north than 51. So what you're going to do then is you're going to find that limiting latitude and you're going to mark that limiting latitude. Now, oftentimes in the question, they're going to tell you what that is. Like they keep mentioning 51 north, 51 north, 51 north. That, they're telling you what the limiting latitude should be. Ah, while remaining south of 51 north. That's why, because it's right in the body of the question. Okay, so uh, uh, what is going to be the minimum distance while remaining south of that thing? Well, okay, so what we're going to do now is we're going to put our pencil. Okay, so look for the limiting latitude. We did that. Okay, and uh, then we're going to place our pencil on the point of departure, which is right over here. Okay. All right, so there's our limiting latitude. We scribe that, all right? Then we put our pencil over there, and then we put our triangle up against our pencil, and then we then what we're going to do is we're going to rotate the triangle until it just, 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 just touches the first place on this line, okay? You're not going to let the triangle cross the line so that it intersects in two places. It's got to just touch. That's what tangent means, okay? So you keep it stuck at the, you keep it stuck right there against your pencil, and then you rotate it using your pencil as a pivot until it just touches the 51 line. And then you stop, and then you draw a line, okay? Then what you're going to do is you're going to repeat the process from the departure. So you put your pencil here, okay? You put your triangle up against that spot, and now you rotate it until it just touches on this side tangent. Draw a line there, okay? Now, what you're going to do is you're going to essentially great circle from here to wherever the tangent spot is, which is right about here. And then we're going to great circle from here to wherever the tangent spot is, which is just about here. And we're going to get rid of all the rest of that stuff. So you'll see this kind of, right, those are the spots where it's tangent. Those are the longitudes where it's tangent. Okay. And we'll erase that. And then so we're going to great circle to about here. Then we'll parallel sail, and then we'll pick up a new great circle there. And that's how you do that. And uh, sometimes they might ask you, uh, what's the longitude that you'll start parallel sailing? I mean, there can be a variety of ways they're going to ask this, but that's how you do that. Hope that helped.